Good morning everyone. It's August the 2nd and we're here at the Soybean Association's Bay Farm Hives and we're going to add some supers to them and see if we could uh, get some nectar from the soybeans that are nearby. Come along as we add these supers. I hope you can hear me. Uh, this hive over here it's got a lot of activity on the entrance, uh, bees coming and going. This one's got quite a bit, not as much as the first one. And this middle one's got some activity, but we're gonna add these supers to all three of these. Uh, Sam and I were up here on Wednesday, July the 31st, and checked the hives. They've got quite a bit of nectar in the supers that are on here on the two bigger hives. Better put my veil on here real quick. Um, and they were, seemed like they were bringing in nectar. So I wanted to see if we can capture any of the soybean nectar. They all have good population. Um, Every one of the frames in this super is covered with bees. There's one, two, three, four, nine frames in here, and they're all being worked. So um, I am going to put a queen excluder on here so I don't have to look for the queen. We don't want them up in the supers. The supers that are on here are going to be left for the bees this winter. So, And these supers are drawn. These are the supers off of the hive at the Soybean Association there in Jeff City. Um, we extract the honey out of them and they're, they've been fed back to the bees, but um, they're still a little wet. So we'll see what they do with them. We're going to do this one next. Again, this one's not as big. There's one, two, three, four, five. About six of the frames are drawn and have bees on them. Um, maybe seven. Yeah, seven of them. So they're working that one. It's a, it was a little later split that we did and it just hasn't done quite as well. Again, we're gonna put a queen excluder on here and add a box. And we're gonna close her back up. stronger of the three hives is this one over here. And we're going to open this up if I can get it over the propolis. And it, this box is full of bees. It looks like they've start capping too much of it but they are bringing in some nectar Oops, forgot my queen excluder I put the queen excluder on this Well, I plan on 
checking some of the soybeans that are nearby and see if they're blooming yet and see if there's any bees on them. So I'll see you in a bit. Here are some of the soybeans that are on the property here. Looks like they're test plots. Um, they're starting to bloom some. I don't see any bees on any of these yet. But uh, there's a pretty good sized test plot here. I'm not sure how big it is, if it's an acre or not. And it's not far from where the hives are. You can see that corn down there. That's where the hives are, just on the other side of that. This must be a different variety. This must be a different variety. It's got purple flowers where the other ones had white flowers. I'm gonna go down through here and see. Yeah, there's purple flowers on these. Those are white. So, going down to the next section here. These are all white. And there's some more purple flowers there. Don't see any bees on them though. So we'll just have to see what happens. Here are more beans that are on, uh, soybeans that are on the property here. So if there is any nectar to be had, there should be plenty of it for those three hives. These soybeans are just across the road from the Soybean property there. I want to go take a look and see if they're blooming or not and what color the blooms are, if there's any bees on them. Just kind of take a quick look. Looks like there's purple blooms. They're really small. But I'm not seeing any bee activity, so. Again, like I said before, we'll just have to wait and see. Well, here's another large field of soybeans. It's probably, I know it's less than a mile from the bees. They could be closer to half to three quarters of a mile. And across the road, more of the same. So, We'll be checking these hives in a week or so and see what they're doing with the supers. And until then, when we see till we see out the bee yard again, happy beekeeping and thanks for watching.